Hey everybody, it's Stephanie and Melissa and today's video is going to be the first video in a four-part series of our hauls in lookbooks from LA and we decided to do four videos because if not they would be really really long so today's video is going to be a haul from the Saturday sale. The Saturday sale is in the wholesale district and it's where the wholesale like um, sellers open up to the public and sell their pieces individually and singly instead of like at a wholesale bundle. One of the things that I got was this leather a leatherette vest. Yeah, a <laughs> leatherette vest. <laughs> um, it's just this black leatherette vest and it has some studding along here if you can see that along a little collar but this was only eight dollars dang i don't know dang, that's a good deal, deal. this is actually the last thing that i bought and they're just these earrings with spikes again but yeah these were only a dollar so i decided to pick them up because you can't find anything like this here yeah. in arizona but this was one of the last things i bought too just this striped top a tank top with spaghetti straps because it's still a hundred degrees here oh my gosh and it's just i thought it was super cute it's kind of like jail, like, yeah, like jail inspired, but done right. So this was only five dollars. I found this pleated skirt. It's just like um, a cream ivory color, and this was only five dollars. Also, if you guys can see that, I told myself I'm not gonna buy anything unless I know I'm going to wear it. And when I saw this, I was kind of like on the fence about it. But now that I look at it, I like it a lot more. So it's just this button down blouse. Um, if you can see it and it's short in the front and longer in the back and it has birds on it It's just like a bird printed black with white birds on it. This yeah. was only five dollars And it's just this white kind of like I don't it kind of reminds me of like a peasanty inspired yeah, top for, And it reminds me of something that free people would sell so it just looks like this Has this little lace stuff on the bottom and this really nice detailing down the front But I saw just like a glimpse of tie-dye and I was like what is me? that? I was like, oh, gotta go see that. So it ended up being like this big oversized orange tie-dye t-shirt with kind of like a bat wing style. The back, it has this braided detailing along the back and down the sleeves, which I thought was really, really unique. And this was only $5. That's everything? No, that's oh, not everything. Oh, I was gonna say. That's not everything. Oh, I be. I was like... <laughs> the next thing... It's from Forever 21, and we have it in stores right now, so you guys can go and pay full price for it. But I only got, I got one for $5. It looks like this. It has stripes going up and down vertically and horizontally down the sleeves. And then down the back, they're going horizontally, but then it just like kind oh, of I didn't cuts that. like this down the back. Super cute. This was only $5. I totally didn't notice the stripes like that. I yeah. got this. It's something that I wouldn't pick up usually but it was only three dollars it's a play suit it's a really cool pattern i like it and then it has the top and then it has bottom legs that go on forever but you know me girls i like to wear the high heels so and it has pockets too and it was only three dollars so i was like i'll pick it up this was the first thing that i bought and it was five dollars i thought he was probably gonna say like 20 bucks but it was only five dollars it's a navy dress just this navy dress with sheer oh, sleeves pretty. and then it's just embellished along the top Nothing. the next two things i got for a deal they were two for 15 so was that 750 a piece the first one is just this little dress Cutie. it ties around here cinches at the waist and then goes down and it's just a gray colored dress you guys are gonna flip when you see this seriously you guys are gonna die this has everything that I've ever wanted in a sheer dress. <laughs> First of all, it's like this cool tie-dye, not tie-dye, what is this stuff called? Shibori? Shibori. I don't know. I think it's shibori. I don't know. If you guys know, let us know. Get this! <laughs> it's asymmetrical! It was like a light was just like focused, like a spotlight on here, and it was like, waving in the imaginary wind, you know? Like it was on some kind of racket like Neiman Marcus. Like, this <laughs> mm. leatherette jacket. Because I need so much leather here in Arizona because it gets so cold. <laughs> now that I think of it, I don't really like this. And I spent 20 bucks on it. 20 bucks for me is like a million for somebody else. This was $20. Just looks like this. Um, 
And this is in stores now for twenty four eighty. So I save four dollars and eighty cents. <laughs> That's a pretty good deal. <laughs> There's always this one stand of guys, like, since we've started going there, that sell their bags for $10 a bag um, on Saturday mornings. And so when I saw this one, I was like, oh, this is sick. It was the only one they had. It was the last one that they had. And it just looks like this. It's just this chain with, like, fake diamantes. Like that. And it came with two straps. This smaller one. This longer one, and then you could also do it like as a clutch if you wanted to. So this was only ten dollars when I saw it. Melissa saw it first, and she's like, "Do you like this?" And I was like, "Yeah, I like it. I'll be here. Ten dollars, ten dollars." I was like, "Nobody's gonna get this. This stuff is like bargain prices for us yeah. because we can't find anything new like that for five dollars anywhere else. Mm -mm. So it really is a really good deal for we us. We don't have a fashion district here. I bought two bags the day before, and I knew I should have held out because I knew I was gonna find something at this sale, and so I got this one. Cutie. But it's like small, so I'll actually use it, and I just love the contrasting colors that it had, so that was $10. It's really big, so I'm like, I don't know, I guess I could use it for school to put like stuff in, but like it's really big, like I don't know, I would, I would use it for a trip. But for 10 bucks, I thought it was a good deal because it has like this lace on it. So I got this, and it's like this sheer cardigan. And it's really nice because it has this detail right here on the shoulders. How much did she give it to me for? I don't know. I think she gave it to me for $7. $7. This is one of the last things that I found. And it's just like this burnt sienna kind of colored... What would you call this? It's like kimono style. Yeah, kind of kimono style. But what I liked about it is it had like these pockets on the front of it. And the guy wouldn't give it to me for $5. He gave it to me for 6 I was like... Fine, whatever. This is one of the last things that I bought, and I really liked it because it had these cutouts, like, on the shoulder right here, but when you put it on, you can't even see the cutouts, so I was like, mm, okay, whatever. It's still pretty. Yeah, it's kind of sheer-ish, but it has this nice detail, like, embroidery-ish on the bottom. Whenever I see something that I like, like, a lot, like, I like the shape of it or, I like, how it's gonna fit, I usually buy it in every single color, and I'm actually wearing one of them right now, this nude color, and then I got this pink color. And it just has, like, it's like a cardigan, and it's, like, see-through, and then it has, like, the detail. It just has, like, the lace on the front of it, which I thought was so cute, which this one has. And I just, like, loved them. These were both $5. I was tempted to buy the black one, but I held no. off. This one was, like, the priciest thing that I think I bought. And it was $10, but I thought this was, like, a go-to kind of style t-shirt that I'll always wear. And I love the color of it because, like, on camera, it's, like, picking up, like, more ivory, but it's kind of more, like... It has like more of a pinky undertone. Yeah, it does. And this was their sample, so there wasn't another one like it, but it has like this really cool detail on the shoulders, like oh, rosettes, and it goes around the back too. It's kind of like something I already have, but not. And then this is just like ombre. It picks up really well on camera. Yeah, and this was only two dollars. The guy had it for two dollars. I was like, I'm buying it then. This is the thing that I regret buying because I was like, when I tried it on, it, it's really ill-fitting. I should have gotten a smaller size, but I was like, no, I'm going to get a really big one. Yeah, no, it's like really big and it fits me really weird. Now that I look at it, it just looks like it's a weird shape. Yeah, it is. It kind of looks like, like something like really, I don't know. Okay, so it's like a button down once again, but just like the mullet one that you had. Mm -hmm. Business in the front party in the back longer and then this is like the coolest part about it so it has like this kind of lace on the sleeves but then check out the back these are like cutouts right here they're like cutouts yeah good demonstration mm -hmm. actually has the price tag still on it from buckle that says it was 49.95 and i got it for six bucks I didn't go crazy this time. Usually I, like, I go crazy. I think I went a little crazy. Yeah, just a little bit. I was like thinking like maybe I should buy more, <laughs> but no. So we had such a good time at the sale yeah. and it happens every Saturday morning for those of you that live in LA or if you're planning on traveling to LA. We'll put um, the location in the description box so you guys can easily find Stay it. Stay tuned for our next video tomorrow and we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye.